Hello, this is Chris of Magoosh. Today, I'm gonna to show you some GRE quantitative comparison tips. So let's dive into this question. Specifically, what I'm gonna show you is ways to save time. Because what we wanna do oftentimes is we wanna calculate, but we don't wanna think logically. Because quantitative comparison questions are all about bigger, equal, or smaller, or can't be determined but we can use logic without actually having to go down the number path. So in this quantitative comparison question, we have zero, and then A is greater than that, then B is greater than the A, C is greater than the B, and one is greater than the C. In column A, we have A times B over C. In column B, we have one. So a quick way to deal with this is whenever you have one on one column, you can always multiply the denominator from the other column. It's kind of like let's just assume the two sides are equal, column A and column B. And so we multiply C by both sides, it gets rid of it in column A, but in column B we now have a C. And so essentially we've rewritten the problem, which is A times B in column A versus C in column B. Which one is greater? Well, we have a fraction. In fact, we have two fractions, A and B. Both are between zero and one. When you multiply two fractions between zero and one by each other, they result in a fraction that is less than both of those. And so let's call this R for result. So R would be in between zero and A. And therefore, we know that it has to be smaller than C, which is greater than both B and A. And what's great about this, we use logic. We didn't actually plug in numbers, though of course you could. You could try one half, one fourth, et cetera but that takes a little bit longer. So if you can get these questions quickly using logic in terms of quantitative comparison, then we are all for that. So you can save your time for some of the harder questions. So hopefully that was helpful. And if you want more tips, check out our GRE free resources link in the description below. And of course, if you want more videos like this one, take a look at the ones on the left.